Hello, Barmy Badger Army. Hey, Badger Army. Welcome to today's show, guys. Today, we're going to be reviewing Batman Jelly Beans. Get right closer to the camera so they can see it. There you are. Batman Jelly Beans by Jelly Belly, one of my favourite companies. I saw these in Sainsbury's the other day in the American section. There's also uh, Wonder Woman and Superman available, but of course, I chose Batman. So, tell us a little bit about Batman, Nick. Well, Batman, not a lot of people know this, but this month actually marks 80 years since, the, since Batman was first published. He was pub, the first uh, com, Batman comic strip was published in Detective Comics, mm -hmm. a uh, comic um, in, the U, in the US, yes. which uh, first started in 1937. Mm -hmm. Long time ago. Yeah. And, the, and uh, the very first Batman comic strip, when he was known as the Batman, mm. with uh, a hyphen in the middle, uh, it was in, was, uh, in the May edition of the mm. issue, was, which was actually published in March 1939. Ooh, okay. And also, of course, Batman was created by Bob Kane, which is well known as, but now, recently, due to a lot of uh, different things that have happened, Bill Finger is now getting the uh, rightful... Uh, place alongside Bill Kane. Bill Kane just had the sole rights to the creation for a long time, but now Bill Finger is actually there, and the family have uh, managed to get his name there as well now as a co-creator, which is fantastic. I'm also going to show you guys some of my favourite Batman films that I rented out the library. You've got the 1989 Batman with Michael Keaton. Ah, uh, uh, yes. And Jack Nicholson, one of my personal favourites. Still still both revered in, in those roles. Most definitely very famous for it. Of course, you've got Batman Returns with Michelle Pfeiffer, Danny DeVito, and, uh, and of course, Michael Keaton, and of course, Christopher Walken. This is insane. Really good cast, this one. And many others as well. Uh, okay, and then you've got Batman Forever. I remember watching that in the cinema in, uh, back in 1995 when it came out. Mmm, very good. What, Batman Returns? Oh, Batman, Batman. Re Batman Returns was 1992, but yeah, I saw Batman Forever in 1995 when it came yes, out. Yes, with Val Kilmer and... Was uh, that the only th that time he was Val, Ki Val Kilmer was, was yes, Batman? Yes, indeed it was, yeah. And of course this one's got uh, Tommy Lee Jones, Val Kilmer, Jim Carrey, Chris O'Donnell and Nicole Kidman. And uh, she is fantastic in it and so are all the other guys. But yeah, Nicole Kidman oozes sex appeal in this. So if you want to see some cool Nicole Kidman stuff, this is really good. Uh, Batman and Robin. Yeah. We need to talk. Of course we do. Now yeah. this is perhaps what killed the Batman franchise a while back. But, you know, it's a good comedy film. It odes to, of course, the 1960s Batman yeah, films. Yeah, so. It's just nothing like the others. It was yes. a real leap. Uh, I mean, George you've got, Clooney was it Alicia Silverstone, Arnold that's Schwarzenegger, right. and once again Chris O'Donnell. A lot of people <laughs> reckon that this is what killed off Chris O'Donnell's career, which is quite you upsetting. Know what, that that wouldn't actually surprise me, but uh, but yeah, I think a lot of other, I think a lot of the other actors struggled. I mean, uh, mm. I mean at that time, I mean George Clooney was very hot property at the time. That's right, and you know, this, uh, it was uh, 1997 like it. that it came out. Mm -hmm. But yeah, he could do no wrong in in lots of people's eyes. Apart from this. And then that happened. And apart from that. Yes, and Joel Schumacher actually released a video apologising for how bad it was. There we go. And of course, there's the bat nipples. But we digress. So, let's open up the Fantastic Jelly Beans. Right, now I'm going to go through what flavours are on there first off. We've got Shimmering Berry Blue. We've got Shimmering Blueberry. Shimmering Cream Soda. Shimmering Wild Blackberry, Shimmering Wild Cherry, and Shimmering Sour Lemon. Shimmering Very Cherry, by the way. Yes, Very Cherry as well. So, yeah. so basically, it's all shimmering. Yes, to go along with this superhero, you know, larger than life idea, I'm guessing they thought they would make them all glittery. With all that shimmering, don't get blinded when you open it. I know. I'm just going to it's like the scene out of Pulp Fiction, you know, when he opens the briefcase. Right, okay. So let's have a bit of a wild dip. You try that one, Nick, which I believe is Look. Shimmering Wild Blackberry. Here we go. And I'll try lemon. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. 
штуку. Should we show, show viewers just how shimmery they are? Uh, exceedingly shimmery. So this one yeah. is... Lots of... Um, so yeah, shimmery, blurry blue. Mmm, yeah. that one's really nice actually. This one's shimmering, I think, very cherry. Okay, yeah, very, cherry. very cherry. I'll try one of those as well. Mmm. Okay. This cherry one's really nice actually. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Right, this one's very blue. Mm. Yeah, what do you think Enjoy. of that one? Mmm. Mmm. I really like this one. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Really tasty, actually. Mm. You don't expect it to taste like that. No, they're really nice. But, um, yeah. Try this one, it's really tasty. So that one is one? cream soda. Oh, cream soda. Mm. Shimmering cream soda. Shimmering cream soda, yeah. Mmm. That is really nice, right? Okay, let's just try a couple more. Oh dear. Good to try some. Good to keep some for Badger Jr. So let's try that one. There's a lot of like, because they're two different blue ones, there's more, there's more mm. of like the blue ones than any other, so. Okay, this one's blueberry. Mmm. I'm going to try sour lemon. Oh, good luck with sour lemon. Not bad, actually. Mm. Flavoursome and not in the worst way. No, but it does have a bit of a tang to it, doesn't it? Mm. 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 That one's really nice, actually. There's not actually any flavours so far where I thought, oh, you know, it's not very nice. Mm. Quite nice, actually. Oh, okay. Let's try another one. Mm. Mm. I mean, mm. I just really like jelly beans. Me too, me too. Mm. But Jelly Belly is, of course, like the top quality brand, isn't it? When you think of American jelly beans, I always go for these ones. I don't know about you, but these are what you would call traditional gourmet jelly beans. You know, they're really nice. Mm. Let's so, have yeah. a little bit of the uh, look at the ingredients. So we've got sugar, glucose syrup, modified cornstarch, blackberry puree, acidity regulators... E297, E325, E330, and E331. Blueberry, I'm going to go get a science puree. degree so I can find out what that means. Flavorings, yeah, me too. Black currant, cherry juice concentrate, glazing agents, uh, E901, E903, <coughs> E904, and colors E100, E153, E171, salt, when contents are randomly assorted and may not contain every flavour, sort of a cool, dry place. That's quite a disclaimer. Indeed it is. But yeah, yeah no, I, I think they're really nice. And I, I props to them for using real puree, actually. Yes. Because other consider, ones wouldn't do that. When you consider the kind of the kind of stuff that often goes into these. Mm. So, yeah. I mean, I... But yeah, I mean, mm. I, I've we've we've tried lots of the uh, lots of the obscure flavored ones, including the uh, the joke flavors, mm, the Harry um, Potter style ones. Yeah, yes. so I actually so uh, actually to to try something that's kind of genuinely nice like mm. that is is refreshing. So what would you give it out of ten, Nick? Oh, I'd give it an eight. Me too, a strong eight, I think definitely, and uh, that is definitely backed up by the fact that they are using, you know, puree and stuff like that. Mm. It, of course, it doesn't get a a 10 because they're using e numbers so you know watch out if your child is sensitive to those is badger genius sensitive to them nah it's all right mm. few indeed so thank you very much everyone for watching and don't forget to like share and subscribe to the show if you are new thank you very much nick for joining me on this taste test oh you're welcome Mm. And I will see you next time. Bye for now, Barmy Badger Army. See you next time, guys. Bye. Ta-ra. Ta-ra.